guys and welcome back to the channel. How are you? How have you been? Well, today we are going to make one of my all-time favorite coconut cookies. They are super delicious, quick, easy, and they are perfect thing for when you want to make a cookie and just don't have any idea what to make. So without further ado, let's go and make them. Here I have a cup of sugar. You can use white sugar, brown sugar, or half of each. But because they are coconut cookies and white, I'm just going to use only white. And then to that, I am going to add half a cup of oil, regular oil. But if you want, to, want it to be super delicious, you can always use coconut oil, which will give it a very nice and delicate taste. And to that, I'm going to add two eggs. We are just going to mix them. You don't have to over mix it just until the egg and the sugar and the oil is well incorporated. After you have incorporated all of your base ingredients, I have two cups of flour which I'm going to add. And to that, I'm going to add three quarters of a teaspoon of baking soda plus three quarters of a teaspoon of baking powder, some, uh, some salt, and a dash of vanilla extract. And then mix everything well. Don't worry if you think that the cookie dough needs more wet ingredients. Just keep mixing. It will all come together. Just make sure that you're not over mixing it. After you have mixed all of the dry ingredients with wet ingredients until they are halfway through, add half a cup of shredded, shredded coconuts. I'm, I'm using unsweetened because the cookie is sweet enough. And then continue to fold them in. Keep in mind that I'm not using electric mixer at all because if you use electric mixer at this point, the cookies will be very tough, like brick hard, and we definitely won't, don't want that. These cookies are super delicate, and as you can see, the cookies are coming together just slowly. And one tip is that you can always press the back of a spoon and then to the side of the bowl, so this will. This way you can incorporate the tough dough much easier and another tip from me is that do not use a wooden spoon or plastic sp spatula on that. God knows how many spatulas and wooden spoons have I broke with the cookie dough. As you can see all of it is coming together and it's even looking very wet although at the first it was so dry. Now that your cookie dough is ready, it's time to put it in your parchment paper. But my tip is to let it chill for about 15 minutes and then we'll put it in our baking, uh, baking sheet. Okay, now that I've chilled my dough for about 15 minutes, it's nice and scoopable and we are going to make little cookies out of it. And after that, we are going to bake it at 180C oven for around 30 minutes. Okay, so our cookies are right out of the oven. You can see I have oven mittens because they are so hot and they have just baked to perfection and yes, and I picked one to taste if they are good and it was so hot. Well, here is our coconut cookies. They are so good, like a piece of heaven melt in your mouth, just enough coconut flavor, just enough sweetness and the easiest thing you can make. If you enjoyed this recipe or even hang out with me, I would love it if you could consider subscribing to the channel or share it with your friends. And as always, please let me know in the comments what other recipes do you want me to make for the future videos. And for more quick videos and recipes, you can watch my shorts part here, which I post almost daily there, and also my Instagram page right here, which you can follow me. And before you go, wait, I have a video prepared for you right here, which is my coconut macarons, another coconut delicious recipe. And Go watch that and I will see you later in another video. Bye!